hello everyone and welcome back to my channel or should i say welcome back to me because i literally haven't uploaded in nearly three months i didn't actually mean to not upload i'm not going to be able to do this but hello baby so little miss olivia she's grown up so much look at her she's nearly two she's two in august i can't believe it so i thought i would pick the camera up today because i just thought do you know what why not i've been overthinking coming back to youtube far too much and i just wanted to see if i knew how to vlog again because we haven't been vlogging for a very long time um i did film i have already filmed a video i've been filming a video of sort of moving around my bedroom so that we can fit little miss olivia in here nicely until we do a loft conversion um so i have kind of got that just finishing editing that but i thought you know what let's let's get up today actually i didn't even mean to like i literally just sat there i was downstairs tidying up and i thought why don't I just wipe the camera out and film instead of overthinking it? So I thought I'd try and put a little bit of a vlog together today. Like I said, I haven't been on YouTube for nearly three months, which is the longest time I've ever gone without vlogging. But I didn't even mean to. I kind of thought I would take... I didn't actually mean to. That's why I haven't said anything about it. I thought I'd take a couple of weeks. Or not even... I didn't even think that. I think I thought I was just going to keep filming. Oh, and before you knew it, um, it's been nearly three months. Little Miss Olivia here has been a little bit um, tiresome, shall we call it? <laughs> yeah. Um, so she's a little bit... Um, so with Olivia, she's been a bit <laughs> hard work. She's the hardest out of all three, out of, all three of my kids um, in terms of like clinginess and stuff. So <laughs> she's like, what? You are, Baba. I'm sorry. You're beautiful and I love you, but she's hard work. So she's been very, very clingy. <laughs> she's funny. She's been very clingy to, um, from about nine months old up until about 18 <coughs> months. She was super clingy, like really bad. Um, and with me going in and out of hospital and stuff, I think it's made it worse. So then after that, she kind of calmed down a bit. And we've just been working on trying to get her into like a bit of a routine. Like trying to be sort, trying to, I've been trying to sort out this bedroom and stuff like that, which I'll show you a little bit now. But I have filmed a video of me kind of doing that a little bit um, to try and make her own area in here, like I say, until we do the loft conversion. But yeah, it's just been a few months, basically. A few months of I don't know what. <coughs> so I'm also showing you... <laughs> I was in the mirror here as well, I didn't realise. So yeah, I thought I would try and put a vlog together today. If this is really shaky, this bit of footage, that's just because I'm holding my arms and I haven't got a... Um, I'm actually filming on my phone. I don't usually film on my phone. Um, but my camera's uh, battery's dead. And you know what? That's another reason why filming doesn't always happen. Because if my battery's dead and I can't find another one or I can't have it charged quick enough... I just go, well, that means I can't film today. So we're not doing that today, are we? We're just getting the phone out and we're just going to see where it goes. It's your daddy's birthday today, isn't it? Now, I don't know what we're going to do because <laughs> kids are at school and I'm not sure what we're doing. But I just thought anyway, even if I'm not filming what we're doing for his birthday, I'll just film whatever I'm doing today in general. So, oh, that's an angry little face. <laughs> I'm not belly rumbling. I think I'm hungry. Um, yeah, so let's get yeah. on. Little miss is aching my arm. <laughs> yeah, just excuse the mess behind me. I'm mid getting ready. But we're going to go out to have a bit of a breakfast brunch for Jonathan's birthday today. So just put a little bit of makeup on. So a little bit of makeup on. I've mucked my eyebrows up. It is what it is. I've just made in a little bit of an effort. But we're going to go there. It's like a little bit of a farm shop type sort of place. It's so, so nice. I went there for my birthday for breakfast. So we're going to go there for Jonathan's as well um, to mark the occasion. And they do really, really nice food. So I'm looking forward to it. So I've made a little bit of an effort and put a bit of a nicer outfit on and not just like a tracksuit. Um, but yeah, let me quickly show you first this little area, which is Olivia's area in my bedroom. Like I said, I've done a video um, separate, but kind of thought I'd just show you well and show you a couple of bits that I got from Timu um, to go in this area as well. So you can see a little bit there. This is her little wall and this is obviously my room. I'm not going to show you the whole room because like I say, it's a bit of a mess. But I'll show you this little area. It's where my wardrobe used to be. So this is what I've done in this little area so far. So this was where my wardrobes, if you remember, my big corner wardrobes used to be here. Um, and I've made it like Olivia's little bedroom, if you like, in our room until we do the loft. I put these stickers on, which I got from Dunelm. And I, like I said, I explained this in the other video and I don't know what's going live first. But I just love the little like toadstool, but the pink version and all the fairies. Olivia's kicking off downstairs. I've got things to go on this wall. 
So I'm thinking of putting, so basically I've got these um, f uh, picture frames from Asda. They were like £6 each. I'm going to put some nice prints in there, you know, like um, sort of kid stuff, either matching this or something else. And the plan is that I'm going to put them on this wall here. And I think I'm going to do, not sure yet, but I might put, you know, like how there's like foliage around here, which by the way, I got this separate in Dunelm and then the lights separate because they're like little daisy lights. How cute are they? Um, and wrapped them around bed. Um, I got her bed from Ikea. It's the Minen, Minen bed or whatever you call it. It's that extendable bed and it's just really cute. But yeah, like I said, I'm going to put the photo frames on here and put the pictures in. Two other things that I did get. I got these from Timu. They really weren't expensive at all, like a couple of quid. Um, and I just thought that these would also be really nice on the wall somewhere. So I'm not finished this area yet, but it's coming together um, just to make it a little bit separate and nice and cosy as her like little room. Um, I also got that Ikea storage for underneath the bed for some of her clothes. Some of her clothes go in my wardrobe and the drawers that are over the other side of the room. But the extras go in here. Um, and I got this little mushroom. I got this. This is so cute, this storage. I got this from... Um, I got it from Home Bargains. It was seventeen ninety nine, and it's just like a little toy storage. So at the moment, I've got toys in it. You could use it for that, or a laundry basket, whatever you fancy. Um, and then I've got this rug from B and M. Um, just make it a little nice, cosy area. I've got loads of books here. She's had them out constantly this morning, and I want to get something, maybe one of those stand up sling things, to put her books in because she loves playing with them or maybe something on the wall with her books in. But I haven't quite made my mind up yet, but I just thought I'd show you this little area because it is really, really cute. And it's just until we get the loft um, conversion. So yeah. <laughs> days later from what you've just saw and um I thought I would carry this vlog on a bit more like a weekly vlog so I've just come back from the school run and I've got a hell of a lot of mess washing and all of that the sun's come out today which I'm really happy about because for the last few days it's literally just been a bit meh so we're gonna sort that out little Miss Olivia is gonna help me aren't you Baba? Are you gonna help Mama? Are you gonna help Mama? She's just literally gone straight into the garden. And that's what I like about days like today because I feel like I'm going to get some stuff done. 
because I don't know what it is. Um, it's not that easy with a toddler to do um, cleaning, like obviously. <laughs> I don't know what it is that they do, but you clean up one room or one area and they've messed the other area up. I've had this for years, so I don't know why I'm so shocked. But yeah, um, I've also been feeling a bit unwell the last few days, hence the reason why I didn't pick the camera up and carry it on. So you might hear it in my voice a bit, but um, it's it's I feel much better today. So I'm going to basically get some washing done first. That's usually what I do when I come back from school run. I like to put some washing on and just clean the kitchen because you know what it's like in the morning when you do the school run. You think, oh God, um, you just run out the door. I don't know what I do anyway. I'm also going to go and do my skin because I haven't done my skincare this morning. Literally run out the door without washing my face because school run, that's what I do. I do want to get in a bit of a better routine where I'm actually doing all of that before the school run. I'll be honest with you, I've been saying that for years. <laughs> I'm not a morning person. I normally do everything when I come back from the school run. So I'm just literally making my coffee as well to get me started. And then, yeah, I'm just going to get on today and see what we can get done. You are aware, this is what I'm talking about. When I start cleaning, this is what she does. She goes in the snack drawer, she empties it. Can we put all that back, Baba? My hoover's is disgusting. I need to clean it. That's another thing I need to clean. I'm scared to clean it because I cleaned my last one and ruined it. Right. Can we put this back in? I do have lots on these drawers, but she's worked it out how to open them, so it's a bit of a nightmare. Can we put it back in? This was all neatly done right, and she literally emptied this yesterday for 50, about 50 times. Can we put all that back in? Good girl, you're going to help mummy. Where does it go? Go on then, put it back in. Oh, she's a good girl. She really is a good girl. She really, really is. No, she's not today. Okay. Oh, mummy do it then. Mummy put it back in. Oh, can you not put it back in for mama? You gonna help my no? Alright, maybe I'll just do it. <laughs> Even if you try, you wouldn't understand it. Maybe something's missing inside of you. Just a bit of sugar to that hobby bitter. Maybe you taste different. Hold up, hold up, baby. I can't sit beside you. While you're going on about your simple life Nothing left you thinking that maybe you're not different It never hit you Our conversation takes to Paying it some interest From time to time Inside all that greatness In all of your adventures You're all alone Hold up, hold up, baby I can't sit beside you While you're going on About your simple life Nothing left you thinking that maybe you're not different
let's just ignore my background because it's a mess. You can see in the mirror, the mess and everything, but it's fine. I'm going to tidy it up in a second. But I just wanted to quickly show you something that I got for Jonathan's birthday. It was, it's actually so cool. That's why I wanted to share it. It's like a bracelet like this. And this is sort of like Jonathan's style anyway. But if you see this bit here, basically you can personalise it and put a picture in there. And what you do is you hold it up to the light like that and you can see the picture that you put in it and i've got a picture you won't be able to be able, i won't be able to show you but maybe i can try and put it on screen which picture it is but it's a picture of when we was on holiday last year um as a family and it's just so cool it is so cool and um, if i remember i'll leave the link below and i say if i remember because you know what i'm like but um it was just so cool it was like one of the best things i bought for him i love a little personalized meaningful thing from the kids and stuff um so yeah i just thought i'd show you because it's coming up to father's day so in case anyone is looking for an idea to get somebody, this is really, really nice. And he really liked it. Um, so, yeah, I just want to show you. And it's basically one of them pull things. So, um, and it fits Jonathan no problem because obviously it pulls to, it pulls tight, loose, whatever. And it's easy to get on and off. Yeah, so I just really wanted to show you that. Um, in terms of me being back on YouTube now... I'm not sure how this vlog looks. It could be all over the place. I've literally just run fit to do a little bit of food shopping with Olivia. Um, I've just changed her for the third time today. So that's interesting. I've tidied up the kitchen. I just need to go and tidy up the rest of the house because basically I was tidying up the kitchen and then I thought I'll quickly go to Aldi because um, as I was tidying up, I was like, actually, we probably need a few bits. And while I was tidying up as well, I was like, do you know what? Like, if you see my, um, like, the dog food um, and all of that, I need a st I need an organisation system, guys. I need an organisation system because I really am wanting to get back into having a nice sort of organised space. You know what I'm like? I'm, you know, proper ADHD, I tell you. I go through phases. <laughs> and because I've not been on YouTube, believe it or not, I've let things go. And it's not because I do it for YouTube, it's because YouTube is actually my motivation. So I really want to get back into organising things. My utility room's kind of gone back to the way it was, but do you know why? It's generally because things get chucked in there when I've got no home, which I need to stop that. And also when we're looking for something, when we go in there, we pull it all out and then it, and then it gets put back in really bad. So I need to sort that out again. Um, but what I really need to do is sort out like organisation. So I'm doing a little job, so I want I want to go to either B and M or IKEA probably, and I'll get some of them big jars where, or maybe some plastic containers. I don't know what yet, um, and put the dog food in there, and then label it up. You know, all the aesthetic stuff, all the stuff that makes you feel like yes, I want to clean and tidy and organise because it makes it just looks nice. So I want to go and do that. Um, so I'll probably go and do that tomorrow. Now I am going to end today's vlog. Um, again, I don't know what you've seen this week. But I'm either, so I don't want to overpromise things and put pressure on myself being back. But I really love the idea of doing more vlogs as well as cleaning on its own. So let me know in the comments if you'd be interested. I feel like if I do vlogs, and it will include cleaning that as well, because obviously that's what I do on a day to day. Um, I feel like I would get more content out to you. It's easier for me to edit and film and all of that so that I can have more content rather than less content. I'll still obviously do my massive cleans. Um, but I really want to upload more and I want to be consistent because that's the one thing that I've clearly not been in the last three months. But before the three months, me coming off YouTube, I was not being consistent. And that was really bothering me, which is probably one of the reasons why I went, I can't. I need to come back when I've got good content for everybody. So let me know in the comments if you'd like to see some vlogs as well. If you enjoyed today's vlog, give it a thumbs up. Um, obviously, I'll do hauls and that as well because obviously I'll buy things and everything. I've got stuff to... I've got another video going up, like I said, I've kind of changing the room around our bedroom. And yeah, I also want to sort my garden out because as you know, I have a dome in my garden, which is lovely. But I've got a funny feeling it's not going to stay. My garden's very small because if you know about new builds, then you'll know that a lot of the gardens are very small. And because of that, and we've having Olivia and it being summer now and she's running around and needs the space for me to be able to get a break... I'm thinking the dome isn't the best thing. I'll tell you why. Because it's getting... At the moment, I'm using it as a shed. At the moment, I've put things in there that I'm waiting to go to the dump. Or things like that. So, I think, I think I'm think i going to have to take it down. As much as I'm sad to see it go, 
I think I'm going to have to take it down to create the bigger space for Olivia to run around because it's a little bit dangerous with it being there. So that will be something that I will vlog. It may be in the next, sort of within the next week because I really want to tidy up the garden and keep, create space, get the pool out and things out because the nice weather's coming in. So yeah, I just really wanted to do a little vlog to be like, this is me back. I'm also going, like I say, I've got another video coming after this, but I would also really like to daily vlog at one point. So hear me out. I'm not promising that it's going to be daily vlogs from this point forward, but I'm going to try my hardest because I really, I've never ever done it. I've never done Vlogmas properly. I've never done any of that. Um, and it's mainly because I feel like I'm boring. Like my life's boring. It's on repeat every day. But then maybe it's not to some because when I watch YouTube videos, um, I watch other mums and I just like to see what they're doing. And you know what? Funny enough, people sit there and say things like, um, oh, you ramble too much. You talk too much and all that. But did you know that when I, and I was thinking about this the other day, when I watch another mum on YouTube, when they're like filming and stuff, you know the bit I love watching the most is when they're talking. It's when they're just talking. I just love it. I just, I skip to it sometimes. I'm like, oh, let me hear what they've got to say. <laughs> and they could be talking about tidying up a room or something or what they've got to do for the day. And it makes me, I don't know what it is, but it makes me either relate to them or it makes me feel like I can get up and do stuff just like they are or whatever it is that they're talking about. It could be just anything. And I just enjoy listening to them. So sorry if you don't like me chatting on here, but I'm gonna. Um, but yeah, I just really wanted to come back and everything else. Like I say, I'm going to really try. Let me know. Give me actually ideas in the comments. Since I've taken such a big break, obviously I'm going to be doing cleaning. So no, no doubt I'll do cleaning. Give me ideas for what type of cleaning you want to see me do. That's a good idea. But not only that, what other videos would you like to see in general? So that I've got an idea of where I'm going forward with this channel. Just so I know that I am sort of filming what you kind of want to see. So, would you be interested in vlogs? Do you want more hauls? Do you want um, more cleaning? Whatever. I know you all love my cleaning, so cleaning's going no, nowhere, never will. I obviously clean all the time anyway, so that's the way it is. I've got loads to sort out in this house, like I've said to you before. This wardrobe here, as I've changed this room around, this wardrobe um, basically everything kind of got chucked in, and it was actually still bad weather when I when I done this. So now what I need to do is I need to switch. So that'll be another vlog coming soon because I need to switch out the wardrobe for summer stuff. That needs to be done ASAP because they're bursting at the seams where I've put a mixture of summer because I've got my summer stuff out and it's, it's everywhere. Everything's everywhere. So I need to switch that around to tidy that up and get rid of stuff. But yeah, that's it. I hope you enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe if you are new and I will see you very, very soon. Bye.